I've been lower than 17th, so I'm happy about that. Yeah. Um, Iceman beat me in his last set. Oh, shit. Good job. Good stuff to him. Proud of him. And now we've got Gemini and who? So Iceman. This might be the most played matchup in the Absolutely, dude. Goddamn. In the last six months, at least. Like, Joe getting some chic warm up from you and me earlier. Oh, absolutely. Well, I, I only played one game chic against him, but, you know. And that's because I switched to Garth real quick because he was looking clean in this match. He was and feeling clean. Sam was saying, 9 volt, sorry. Yeah, you're good. Uh, 9 volt. Was saying Joe was like on fire against him. Oh, yeah. So we'll see. I think this is going to be a good competitive set. Joe and I went to game four and I played Sheik for all of it. And uh, I was keeping up at the end there, but it was a bit, a bit tough. A little bit tough. Uh, Gemini getting right back into the scene in the last oh, couple of weeks after a little bit of a break and actually I think has lost to Iceman three maybe four really? times I did not know that. two weeks. Shit dude. But I, I think he's he said he's, wow. on, he's on one today. Shine up air. Well. He is man. He's feeling comfy. Yeah. Dude, and, earlier? And a comfortable Joe who's moving around. Oh like, no man. Hold on to your butts. Like, I know you can attest to this. Earlier we were talking about how uh Joe really doesn't get scared in the corner. It just depends. But, like, today he has been so confident in the corner. It, he went against Terminal earlier, and he was on the left corner, or in the left corner, rather, of Stadium. And Terminal was trying to, like, nair at him. And he stood there and lasered two or three times, and Terminal put up shield. The second he put on shield, Joe forced him all the way to the right corner and took the stock. That is somebody who is comfy in the corner. And all the same, that's not necessarily somewhere you want to be as Falco, especially against Marth. Sheik, you might be able to shimmy your way center stage just a tad more, but both Gemini and Iceman looking really good tonight. Yep. Okay, so Iceman falling for the same trap twice in a row. Yes, sir. Gemini comes in with that low laser, and you think, uh, Fal Falco, Falco just can't punish me here. I'm just going to act out a shield after his laser, but you can instantly shine when you touch Sure can. And that's gotten Joe's oh, wow. last two openings. <laughs> Running shine grab. This up. See if he gets this edge guard. You never yes, quite know, but very disciplined. Joe moving a lot faster right now than he was a little earlier in bracket. He definitely uh, should have not tried to counter hit there. Just like, except. I absolutely agree. Accept it. Uh, it's going to cost him the stock. Let's see if he can clean it up a little. But Iceman, though, just moving wow, that around where Falco Wow, moving on that left I platform a minute ago. Wow, that was really nice. She's making it so hard for Falco to get hit, which is something she can do. She's small, wow. she's fast. That falling Nair from Gemini a second ago. Good lord, that was good. Earlier. I love the Shine back airs. Oh, me too. Shine Bear, one of my favorite things in Melee. Good shit. He did, um, on Stadium versus Terminal earlier, he did, um, he ran off the left flat, and I would have bet money that he was going to dare, but he actually just fast fell towards Marth and shined and got a stock off of it. And I'm like, that's a really clean mix-up. Joe getting really aggressive here. Scary game. it up. Oh, that spot dodge just saved him. Big nice time. man starting to play his game though. Oh, wow, the, the phantom, phantom shine. shine. Yikes. I've seen so many phantoms today. I don't Me know too. What it is. I was gonna say I've seen so many like spaghetti melee moments. Phantom shines or just phantom things in general. It's been a weird day for melee, but it's been a good day for melee. It has been a good day. Oh that shield pressure. Yeah, I wouldn't mind seeing a bit more uh shining on shield for Joe. Or from Joe rather. So let's see if Joe can get a Joe a Gemini stock. Yeah, Gemini stock. It starts up. And this is where he starts putting on. Oh, oh he no! Do that. Double laser, laser from Ledge. Iceman's so ready for it, pulling the trigger. Uh, I kind of wow. like felt in my soul that that was going to happen because I saw Joe grab Ledge, and time stopped, and I saw him dropping from Ledge and double lasering. And then I saw what happened happen. I was like, yep, that's. And he's taking it right back, as he in should. That, in that situation, he. Iceman just had the hard read because he could have just re ledge restalled. Sure Iceman did. said, no, you are going to jump right now and I'm here to punch yep. you. So maybe see if Gemini adapts, you know, just cleans up a little thing to the defensive side. If he's a little more careful when he's off stage, I think he'll be fine sealing it up. Iceman really making him focus and play hard, though. Two of Dayton's finest for sure. Iceman quickly becoming... A serious, seriously good player in Ohio in general. I don't even really know how long he's been playing, but 
Oh, he went for that Nair, and then the Nair happened. I really love that Nair with Sheik, because especially against Falco, like, how do you recover from that? It's... It's hard. You gotta get the cleanest angle, or to do. the short that goes just around it. Exactly, and even then, Sheik might be ready for either put fair or... Ooh, the next one's be Whoop. Whoa, that was a really nice fair. Like, double fair from Platt. You love to see it? Oh. Double dip. And he misses the second up air. They're swagging out. Up there. They are swagging out indeed. Joe moving a little bit more. Wow, another phantom hit. Another phantom hit. That's kind of crazy. Not that time, though. Joe working really hard to try and get back center stage. Wow, that, that second laser, though. Yep, there we go. Looking like a Gemini stock. Oh okay. wow, what a bear! Seriously. That, oh, ooh, okay. That Falco dash attack can just work out for you sometimes. It it's can. A move. It's in your face for a long time. Ice and Man's still ready. Space, in, oh man, only one of those needles hit though. Oh, look at this. Mm. Wow, what what a wow, dance they the just did. Grab, I love that. Me too. And Joe, like, like wave surf forward, pivoted, wave dash oh, back, did it again, and, nice and got a stock for it. Joe. Gemini, I'm sorry, I, just, I know him as Hell yeah. As Joe. Me too. No complaints so far. Seems like the tide. Ferris likes my tweet. Back and forth and but Gemini, I would say, has been keeping up the, the pressure a little more. Another overextension at the edge. Can I get him punished? Ooh, that's there air. though. And Another then one. Forward air. Looking like PP. <laughs> Looking like PP. <pee> <gasps> oh, oh man, I wish he wouldn't have tournament winner there. Man. I, I know Joe, and he's beating himself up for that right now. He respawns and went right to the edge. Yeah, right to the edge. Absolutely. Uh, you scare me, Gemini. <laughs> I feel it. Wow, it's what a power shield. To watch. Oh, wow, that's kind of okay. weird. Second place again? No, Iceman reads it though. Oh, he just crashed and waited because he thought he was coming. He's like, alright, cool, now I can wave dash back, run back in with a shine. Joe is now playing his stock very safe. He's yeah, he goes sure down is. Could have gone for the Simeon Slam. Would have won him the whole game. Set. Wow, these oh. up airs though? Oh my god. Oh, wow. I'm not sure if he meant to do that though. No. Um, it happens. So when they have the whole thing of like opening kills or whatever, should it be a higher load number? Like which one's better? A load number. That's what happened and I thought. Uh, an opening per kill of one means you kill them every single time you hit them at. That's what I thought. Good shit. So Evan was right. So I'll have to tell him what, that later. What was the opening per kill right there? Ooh, I want to say it might have been four. For it might have been like four. Ah. Uh, so Poor Joe. now that I think about it. Oh, his yeah. controller's messing up again. Yeah, exactly. I heard that outside. Yeah, look, he's holding it up. He's holding it up on the camera. Oh man, this happened to me and him earlier. Poor Joe is having the worst issues with his, his controller. I hope the set's not over. I yeah, I don't know, actually, man. I don't know.